10 recommended shrubs with white flowers Korean spice viburnum, viburnum carlisi, is an example of a shrub that boasts early spring flowers April, as well as fall color. The buds are pink but then open to become clusters of white flowers. The bush is named for its fragrance, which contains a combination of sweetness and sharpness. If you do not like the touch of pink that its white flowers retain, grow double file viburnum, viburnum plicatum var. Tomentosum, marisi, instead. The double file type has pure white flowers but lacks the scent of Korean spice. For a purely sweet smell, it is hard to beat the fragrance of the common lilac bush, which is available in whites as well as in the familiar lavender, purple. The smell of the flowers is superior to that of the Miss Kim lilac, although some gardeners prefer the latter as a compact plant that reduces landscape maintenance. But if you are seeking plants for a hedge that will screen out prying eyes during the summer season, the height of the common lilac is a decided benefit. Unlike Korean spice viburnum, common lilac is a late spring bloomer, but it makes up for the weight by bearing larger racemes of flowers. Andromeda shrub, also known as Japanese pieris, has a scent that is not for the faint of heart. Some people dislike the aroma, while others love it. So before you grow this bush, find one in bloom somewhere and see if it passes the smell test for you. Beyond the bell-shaped flowers, the benefits of growing Andromeda include evergreen foliage offering winter interest, leaves that offer an attractive red color, such as with the mountain fire cultivar, and an early bloom period March, in some cases. Andromeda shrubs grow to 9 to 12 feet. If you enjoy experiencing fragrances in the garden but dislike strong smells, mock orange may be just right for you. Mock orange comprises a number of species within the Philadelphus genus, as well as hybrids and cultivars. Its aroma will not blow you away, but a refined nose can detect a hint of citrus in its blossoms. This is a rather big shrub, reaching 12 feet tall with a similar width. A popular hybrid, PX virginalis, stays smaller, 4 feet tall with a spread of 2 feet. Lovers of summertime privacy may prefer P. coronarius, but those who wish to keep yard maintenance to a minimum will favor P. ex virginalis. Azaleas can bloom in early spring or late spring, depending on the variety. Great white varieties include Northern High Lights, Pleasant White, Delaware Valley White, Cascade White, Snow, and Bloom a Thon White, so called because it blooms not only in April but also in the summer and fall. Hardiness zones and sizes depend on variety, there are azaleas suitable for most climates from zones 3 to 9, and in sizes ranging from 2 to 3 feet to 15 feet. Azaleas are excellent in woodland settings, the foliage is unremarkable after the flowers have faded, although some varieties have pleasing fall colors. What makes dwarf Deutzia, Deutzia gracilis, Nico, so special is that, despite being a shrub, it can function as a ground cover. This is because it stays so short and is wider than it is tall, 2 feet tall with a spread of 5 feet. The flowers may be small, but they are double and numerous, this is a late spring bloomer, with small but fragrant bell-shaped flowers. The foliage on the dwarf variety turns an attractive burgundy in fall. Individual branches are fairly short-lived, so this shrub needs regular pruning. According to the meanings assigned to the various rose colors, white roses signify reverence and humility. If such concerns are too fanciful for your tastes, you may be drawn more to roses by their beauty and their smell. No fragrance garden is complete without rose bushes. Roses have a reputation for being finicky, but there are some types, such as shrub roses, that are quite easy to grow. Like most plants with large flowers, roses are heavy feeders. Use a slow-release granular fertilizer formulated for roses. Like roses, to which they are related, shrubs in the Spirea genus also bloom in early summer. Although some of the more popular kinds of Spirea now have pink blossoms, the traditional favorite with white flowers is the Van Hout or bridal wreath, Spirea, Spirea times Van Houte. Van Hout Spirea likes full sun and grows to be 5 to 8 feet tall and 7 to 10 feet wide. It blooms in April or May. Snow Mound and Snowstorm are cultivars with white flowers. 
Hydrangea is another early summer bloomer, and there are excellent white versions available in all four of the main types, H. arborescens, smooth hydrangeas, H. macrophylla, big leaf hydrangeas, H. paniculata, panicle hydrangeas, and H. quercifolia, oak leaf hydrangeas. Another white flowering option is Snows of Kilimanjaro, a tropical shrub with a rounded shape, growing 6 to 10 feet with a spread of 4 to 6 feet. As a member of the Euphorbia genus, it is related to that Christmas favorite, the Poinsettia e. Pulcherima. An alternate common name is Little Christmas Flower. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more interesting videos. And please hit the like button for the YouTube algorithm.